guys, how you doing? This is your boy Rich from Rich TV Live and Rich Pigs Daily, the only platform in the world where you can join and win, whether you're a VIP member or a free member, go to richpigsdaily.com and you can win free cash. It's true. Now, I want to talk to you today about our world famous top 10 picks that we've been doing for years and we've been hitting home run after home run after home run. Speaking of home runs, the Blue Jays, the Toronto Blue Jays have been hitting a lot of home runs lately. They just broke the record. They got four players with 100 RBIs this year. Congratulations to the Toronto Blue Jays. We hope you guys make the playoffs. You deserve it. If you make the playoffs, you might go all the way. Could be the first time since 1992, 1993 that the Blue Jays win the World Series. That's how good of a team they have. Now, let's switch our focus to the home runs in the stock market. All right, so I got 10 picks for you today. Are you ready? Because this bad boy was born ready. Let's go. So I want to share my screen here, and we're going to go to Trading View, okay? And in number 10 for October, Lucid Motors. So you can see here, we've got the chart marked, and you can see that, in my opinion, anything under $20 is a really good buy zone. And Lucid's been as high as 60 when all the hype with electric vehicles was happening. Lucid was all over it. You can see they really exploded all the way up to these higher levels. And they've recently come down and they've been trading in this like $18, $17 zone for quite some time. But just recently, we've seen Lucid Motors take a huge move up. You can see right here, this huge move up for Lucid Motors. And I think this trend may continue. They are down today, 3%. 3%. But overall, over the last little while, they've really been making a huge move up. That's why I've got Lucid Motors on my list for top 10 picks for October 2021. They are number 10 pick, and I think they have a chance to be an absolute rocket. In fact, they were talking about it on CNBC that they could potentially be the Ferrari of electric vehicle stocks. Wow. Imagine that. That would be absolutely epic. Could you just imagine what that would mean for Lucid Motors? Now, what I want to do is I want to make sure that everybody is aware of UROY. They are my number nine pick for October. UROY, Uranium Royalty Corp. For miners, they've been beat up. And I think now's the time to start thinking about getting into miners. And you can see Uranium Royalty Corp, U-R-O-Y, has been on this epic tear up. It's been making this move up. You can see this right here. See this big move up? And I just think they made this big move down. I just think that this is one to watch. I think that miners right now are very undervalued, underappreciated, underexposed. Everyone's forgetting about miners and I'm not talking about crypto miners. I'm talking about actually mining stocks. And this is one that's been making a nice move. And I think everyone should be aware of it. The symbol in Canada is URC, Uranium Royalty Corp. They're my number nine pick for October 2021. And number eight, this is actually a pick that I brought you guys first. It was one of my first ever picks that we talked about on Rich TV Live when it was around a dollar. They are now trading at $8.21 in America over $11 in Canada, an absolute rocket, another 10 bagger for our community, standard lithium. Told you guys, I'm getting into these mining stocks. I think right now is the time. Lithium is needed for electric vehicles. Standard lithium has been on a tear. I think everybody needs to be aware of this rocket. Put it on your watch list, put it on your radar. It's been a big winner. And I think it could continue standard lithium. Symbol in Canada, SLI. Symbol in America, equally SLI. Now, in number seven, I'm a big fan of gold. Gold stocks, look at the chart. We're right at the bottom. We're literally lower than our buy zone. This is Barrick Gold. This is like the biggest gold company. I would say in the top two gold companies in the world, currently trading at $18. I think the upside is tremendous. I think we could see them go for a big ride. If gold turns around, you need to start with Barrett Gold. Only at $18 in America, I feel like the upside is tremendous. And the symbol in Canada, A, 
BX. As you can see here, right at a bottom. I mean, you can literally circle it. We are at the bottom, okay, for Barrick Gold. You can literally see that the RSI just coming off a bottom here recently. Um, still pretty low in a buy zone, in my opinion. They're my number seven pick for October 2021. Now, in number six, another gold play, Kinross Gold. You can see I've got this mark. It's trading underneath our buy zone. Kinross Gold, K in Canada, KGC in America, our number six pick for October 2021. If gold turns around, Barrick Gold, Kinross Gold, Uranium Royalty Corp are all picks, standard lithium, four picks that could really make your October a profitable one. And in number five, we're going to switch gears to cannabis stocks that nobody's really been paying attention to. Look at this. Look at Village Farms. They got a tight float, only 80 million shares. Cannabis has been beat up. The Safe Banking Act has just been passed in America. I think that's going to be rocket fuel for cannabis stocks. We're going into cannabis stock season. We're going into small cap season right now. VFF in Canada, Village Farms, VFF in America, only right now at $8, really right around a 52-week low. The upside is tremendous. I think this could easily double. Put them on your watch list. Put them on your radar. They're my number five pick for October 20. 21. Now in number four, Planet 13. I brought you guys this pick first. I love them since day one. Planet 13, currently at $5.84. Look at these charts. This could looks like an easy double. Once again, relatively tight float, around 100 million shares, growing revenues, Safe Banking Act passed, and only at five bucks in Canada, $5.84. Even cheaper in America, $4.60. Look at this. We're right around a bottom, folks. And I mean, this is as good as it gets. I think the upside is tremendous. I think we have a chance to make a multiple here with Planet 13. I was the first one ever to talk about Planet 13. It went up. Now it's come back down and they're back in my top 10. Planet 13, number four in October 2021. And in number three, we had to get an oil and gas play on here. We had to get a dividend play on here. Suncor. I think this list is phenomenal because we've got a nice combination of all the best types of industries in the world. You need an oil and gas play. Oil's been on fire. I predicted when oil was negative a couple of years ago that oil would make an epic rebound and oil would go back to $50, $60 a barrel. It's back over $70 a barrel now, the highest in three years, despite that Suncor has so much room for growth. I absolutely love Suncor. You could see we marked it here on the chart. It just came off a bottom. I just think for a dividend stock, it's got a nice dividend, about 3%. Symbol is Suncor is SU in Canada and SU in the United States. I think the upside is tremendous. Put them on your watch list. Put them on your radar. I absolutely love Suncor at these levels. And I think that they have a chance to really run up with the price of oil going up. These companies' quarterly revenues should be outstanding. I think that's going to be a catalyst for them in earnings season, which we're just a couple of weeks away. So put Suncor on your watch list, on your radar. I think it has a chance to be a huge winner. And number two, okay, full disclosure, I own a lot of shares of Pfizer. I believe that these guys are going to continue to grow. I heard a statistic that said that with booster shots, most likely being approved sometime in the next few months for 2022, Pfizer could make $26 billion on booster shots alone in 2022. I think that that's an outstanding target. Um, that's a huge number. I feel like this is a company whose revenue is growing exponentially. They also have a nice dividend. It is my number one holding right now. It's been a big winner for me and for the community all year. Pfizer, PFE, put it on your watches. Put on your radar. You can see they've come down from the, the all-time high of $51. They've just had a nice dip. They're at this $43 mark. I think they go higher from here this month. Put it on your watches. Put it on your radar. And in number one, wonderful, wonderful. Kevin O'Leary, Sam Bankman-Fried, Sean Clark, Josh Richards. They have Ben Samaru. They have a dream team. W-O-N-D-F in America is the symbol. 
WNDR is the symbol in Canada. Wonderful, wonderfy. I think everybody should put this company on their radar, put it on their watch list. They just did their IPO. And I think that this company has a chance to be an absolute rocket. I think these prices are literally just a little taste of what we're going to get here. I think this is a future 10X, if not higher. That's right. I think this is a future 10X, if not higher. They're currently trading right around where they started IPO day when we brought it to you guys first. They had a nice move up. They've come back down. And I feel like these are the levels where investors need to position themselves. And I think this is a pick you want to hold long. Now, I must remind you guys that Rich TV Live is strictly for information and education purposes. I'm an investor just like you guys. Do your due diligence, do your research before you invest in anything that we talked about here on Rich TV Live. In my opinion, invest in the best. The best is blessed. And you absolutely deserve the best. I think this is a chance to be a rocket. And I always tell you guys, when you have a chance to buy a rocket, take that rocket and put it in your pocket. This is your boy, Rich, from Rich TV Live. If you like these videos, smash the like button, comment down below, share the video everywhere, and subscribe if you're alive. This is your boy, Rich, from Rich TV Live. We bring in the winners, and we bring in them to you first. We've been doing this for years. We've got an impeccable track record. This is one of the best top 10 lists I've ever put together. It feels like every single month I say that, and that's because I believe as a trader, I am becoming better every single day and every single month. I think this month, this, this list is gold. I think this is gold. We've got some gold. We've got some cannabis. We've got digital gold with Wonderfy. So put them all on your watches, put them on your radar and let me know if you think I missed something, put it in the chat. Let me know what I missed, but I don't think I missed much. I think this is a great list. It's diversified. We've got dividend stocks. We've got a couple of small caps, but for the most part, we've got some great companies on this list. Some at bottoms, some that are a little bit higher, but I think have a long way to go. So thank you guys for watching. If you're not winning, you're not watching. We bring in the winners and we bring them to you first. Thank you for watching, everybody. It's your boy, Rich, from Rich TV Live and richpicksdaily.com saying, join the club. I'm out. Peace. Happy hunting, everybody. Have a profitable October. I'll see you guys soon. I'm out.